Hey, guys welcome back to the channel Canada Immigration. We will talk about how can I demonstrate to the IRCC my relationship with my spouse or partner. If you are interested in this topic please watch till the end of this video for the latest immigration updates and news. Please like this video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and don't forget to hit that notification bell icon. Let's get into the video. You may sponsor a foreign national to move in with you in Canada and become a permanent resident if you are a Canadian citizen or permanent resident who is in a relationship with that individual your spouse, common law partner, or romantic companion may be sponsored. You must be able to show that your relationship with the sponsored individual is sincere by offering proof and accompanying paperwork in order to qualify for spousal or common law partner sponsorship whether you are married or have a partner will affect the criteria for demonstrating your connection. Demonstrating your relationship to your partner. A list of documents that can be used to verify your relationship with your spouse is provided by Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada IRCC, including. 1. A completed, relationship information and sponsorship evaluation, section of the IMM 5532 questionnaire. 2. A marriage license and evidence that the union was officially registered with a government body. 3. If your spouse has a divorce record, you must provide it. For long-form birth certificates or adoption paperwork with the names of both parents are required if you share children. 5. Photographs and wedding invites. Couples must additionally present proof from at least two of the following sources. 1. Evidence of shared ownership of a home. 2. Rental agreement demonstrating that the couple is a resident of the home. 3. Evidence of shared bank accounts, credit cards, or utilities, such as power, gas, telephone, and the internet. For the couple's shared address has been listed on their auto insurance policy, according to the policy. 5. A piece of official identification, such as a driver licensee bearing the same address. 6. Various more records proving the pair shares a residence, such as phone bills, pay stubs, tax records, etc. Demonstrating your partnership with your partner. Additionally, the IRCC provides a list of documents that can be used as proof of your connection with your spouse, among them. A completed, relationship information and sponsorship evaluation, section of the IMM 5532 questionnaire. Proof of divorce from a prior spouse, if either party was previously wed. A completed IMM 5519 form if one of the partners has ever been in a common law union with another person. If the couple shares children, long-form birth certificates with both parents' names. Now talk about photographs of the pair. Couples must additionally provide two sets of documentation from each of the following categories, or a written justification if you are unable to submit evidence from two or more of these categories. One document attesting to the couple's status as common law partners, such as employment or insurance benefits. Two evidence of the couple's shared costs or financial support. Three evidence that friends and or family are aware of the connection, letters, social media information showing the relationship is public. The pair must present proof of at least two of the following sets of documents if they are cohabitating. One evidence of the couple's shared ownership of a home or a rental agreement proving they live there. Two a record of shared utility accounts, such as electricity, gas, telephone, internet. Three dual bank accounts or credit cards. For the couple's shared address has been listed on their auto insurance policy, according to the policy. 5. A piece of official identification, such as Rivers licensing the same address. Other records provided to the couple that demonstrated, such as cell phone bills, pay stubs, financial statements, tax records, insurance policies, etc. If the couple is not now cohabitating, they must provide proof that they were previously cohabitating for at least a year by doing the following. 1. Evidence indicating they have communicated with each other through letters, written text messages, emails, social media posts, or other papers. There shouldn't be more than 10 pages in this. 2. Passport photocopies with stamps and airline tickets or boarding cards are proof that the Canadian citizen or permanent resident has visited their partner. 
when filling out the IMM 5532 questionnaire, the sponsored person must provide an explanation if visits were not made, Part C, Question 4. Hopefully, the details and information presented in this video are helpful. So what is your opinion about today's information, definitely tell us by commenting. And on which topic we should make the next video, you must tell by commenting. We will try to reach you with the latest information related to Canadian immigration. If you have not subscribed, please like this video and subscribe to the channel don't forget to click on that notifications bell icon. See you sooner in next new immigration video.